it's uh it's not the worst, I guess. It's not the worst. Somebody please help me! <laughs> hey you! Please! You gotta help me! What's up, bud? What's the problem? I broke into our place. I got away, but they got my wife, please, mister. Oh you asshole! Gotta do something. Sure, I'll help you, buddy. Where is she? It's a sacked out in the swamp by the water. <laughs> okay. Go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Uh, I go about finding more help. Uh, all right, buddy. Don't don't worry, man. I'll save your wife. All right, bud. Wait, I need to uh, eat some shit. Yeah, give me some baked beans. Yum yum. <laughs> Sorry about that, horse. Yep. Sorry. Yeah. What's that? Oh, Gator. We don't care about Gators right now. Ah, oh, shit! Is that, is that the woman I heard? Don't worry, I'm coming to help. Let, let's let me loot these guys real quick. Some scum of your. Would you please? Sorry, I weren't here sooner. Are... Oh, 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 right, let's get you out of the binder, all right? All right, you're good now. You're good now. Woo! That's a nasty you bullet saved hole. My honor. Christ! What a mess! My knee. Would you please get them out of here? Touch him, and I don't want to ride indoors. All right, all right, let's get rid of you guys. Meow. Off you go. All right, we can hear you. Just one more. Yep, yep, I got it. Don't worry, don't worry. Oh, did I go that quick? Jesus. Here you go. You lay down with your friend. Yeah, sneak each other's ass, why don't you? Alright, ma'am. Everything's There's some done. money I put away in the sack there. It ain't enough, but please take it. Sack? Oh. You're alright now, ma'am. It's over. Let's hope my Horace found another guardian angel like you. <sighs> oh, thank you again. You my guardian angel. Ooh, 50 Appreciate bucks. it. Okay. Good luck to you. Not bad, not bad. I guess uh, they can keep those guys in horses then, huh? Because I don't got yep. any from. That's a game yeah. Oh, my. Can we check out this cabin? Ah. There'd be something in there, right? I get the hair out of my face. Oh, is this a graveyard? Oh, shit. Anyone home? Oh no, this place is boarded up. No one's home. I'm surprised that didn't, uh, you know, affect my morale, not my morale, but my reputation badly. Because I, I low-key did just loot a fucking grave. Oh, new plant? It, ain't this just a cat sale? Bull rush, okay. Oh, well, what was that? Got more? I saw it appear for a second, where is it? Oh, oh, here it is, here it is.
Wild Mint. Oh, we got quite a bit. Oh. Might as well just take them, right? I don't, I don't know what I'm doing with them, but. But wait, no, I could make medicine with them. That's what I can do with them, right? Just have to use the little campfire thing. Alright, that's enough of that. Uh, looks like we could rob a bank, so we might as well get that on over with, too. And then, uh, we'll do just as quick. Oh, wait, oh, we're already here? <laughs> Didn't really lose that close. Alright. Get that horse away from you! Okay, take it easy. Oh! Ah, uh, hello, Mr. Morgan. Come here, Arthur. Ah, uh, it's with this guy. What do you want? Michael, Michael, Always Michael. Always full of sunshine, ain't you? Old Misery Guts Morgan. What do you want, Michael? Hmm. Well, I, I want a friend, Arthur. I want hope. I want tomorrow to mean more than today. I want this whole damn shit show to have some kind of meaning I haven't understood. <laughs> but I ain't holding my breath. Yeah, I wouldn't. So, instead of that, how about you and me go and redistribute some property? Redistribute? Yep. From the Bowles Overland Stagecoach Company into our pockets. And you'll fight this time? I always fight. No, you always talk. But with coaches, guns are more significant than words. Oh, I'm fine with both, friend. Yeah. Come on, then. <laughs> you think we need an extra gun? Probably a good idea. Bill, come on. What are we doing? Coach, stick up. Well, actually, I'm in. Micah and Bill, this is a death sentence. There's a good spot where we can hit it as it comes over the river into the swamps north of here. You got an actual plan this time? I got three sticks of dynamite, I got two pistols, I got you and Bill. That count as a plan? No. Not really. Well, let's go. <laughs> I'm joking. So, who told you about this? Please tell me it wasn't an O'Driscoll this time. Nope, a man on the inside at Bowles Overland. You can keep your funny little station friend in Rhodes. I go right to the source. Why did he tip you off? Charm, Bill. Not something you can... Oops. Easy. Not you something got you can either, learn, Michael. I regret to inform you. Very you don't got no charm true. either. You're proof of that. Amusing. Charm. And a little money. Right. Which I recovered the next day when he met with a tragic boating accident. See, I don't like leaving trails, unlike the rest of you. What do you mean by that? We keep leading trouble right to us. We're carrying too much dead weight. We need to be leaner so we can move faster, quieter. I prefer a tight crew. Just five or six strong gunmen. Well... Nobody's stopping you. There's a whole world out there. Oh, my dead eyes gone. Go find the strong men you want and leave. Hey, I like you boys. And with the price on our heads, we are wedded in this chaos, for better or for worse at this point. It would be a coward's move to bail on Dutch now. Not like John did. Heard about him disappearing on you fellas for a year. Wasn't it? Something like that. Let's cut across here. It'll be quicker. I don't trust him. I've been talking to Dutch. Feels to me like he's turned, challenging every move Dutch makes. I know you have your doubts about him too, Morgan. I got no doubts about John. I've known him for 15 years. Well, if we really are gonna escape somewhere like me and Dutch have been talking about, we're gonna need to cut some loose. From what Dutch says, the coffers are looking pretty good again. We could almost leave now if we chopped half the dead wood. We ain't doing that. I mean, why the hell do we need a gaggle of girls who won't even fuck you if you put a gun to their head? I'm sure you've tried. 
Is it too much to ask, considering they get a piece of every damn dollar I bring in? Okay, okay why did I just stop here we are. Oh, that's why. I'll get the explosives planted. Coach should be coming through any minute now. All right, let's go ahead, put on the mask. Them in the road over here so he can blow it as it comes over the bridge got some good cover over here you hide behind this tree to my left morgan williamson you take the other side all right now we wait for oh, oh, I, see, I think i see it we don't want to spook them gotta retie my hair it wasn't tight enough that's really dumb. Oh, I, I see them close. I see them inching in. It ain't gonna be this easy. I know that for sure. We're gonna have some action here. Here they come. You gonna shoot the charges, Morgan? About time you did something. Ah, he's making me do the work. Come on. I like how the stage goes is just chilling while there's gunfire in there. Oh! I feel sorry for that guy. Oh damn! Jesus! Where was the other guy on there? Have some more big beans, Arthur. Yum yum. Delicious. Because I got the lead on this, and Williamson's a half wit. Hi. I'm joking, Bill. No. Oh, what? Got to get him from the door. Oh, yep. It didn't even open. What? <laughs> How much we get, cowpoke? Enough. Here. Thank you kindly. Thank you. Maybe I had you wrong, Arthur. Maybe you can win as well as fight. Or maybe you was lucky. Uh, we'll see, I guess, how lucky any of us is. Exactly. All right. Is that a bullet hole I have in my Split hat? Up, That's reckon. unacceptable. <laughs> you can't be having no bullet holes on my hat. Yeah, that is one. Ah, oh, come on. My hat got damaged. All right, while I'm here, I might as well just leave. These poor horses, man. They didn't deserve to get blown up like that. But I had to do it under uh, Micah's orders. I swear to God, if someone crosses this bridge and sees me looting, bro, <laughs> I'm probably gonna go on a killing screen. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, let's just dip now. Go back to base camp and, uh. Yeah, we'll. Oh? Hmm. Should we do this one? Saint Denis. Nah, let's just do the main quest right now. I kind of need a re I, I need a refill on ammo too because I got none. So that is something I need to do as well. Which is why I was uh, thinking about going to Saint Denis, but eh, it's whatever. No way, I can just restock at a uh, home camp, can't I? I think I can. Right? Say, can I hit something? Because <laughs> I was missing so many fucking shots here, man. Jesus. Mm. 
All right, come back here, horsey. Let's get on out of here. These Limon Ragers can go fuck off. I'm not gonna even bother looting their corpses. Come on, girl. Too much work. Yeah. We're just gonna go on and dip. Might as well rest up back at uh, camp too. We'll rest up, then we'll do the Duchess quest. That's the plan here. Put on, uh, do something real quick while we're in cinematic mode. I don't know what you want I'm about to do. done here. There you go. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, well, I waited to hear that noise for so long. Yeah, I bet. I, I wish I could give you some money or, well, you know, I might have something. You gotta give me information. Some fat already know. feller and his wife had a pig oh, yep. farm uh, northeast of Rhodes, near the border with Roanoke. Word is he's got piles of money. You sure I'm the right person for this sort of information? I ain't saying nothing. Do with it what you will. All right, off we go. Back to camp. Calm down, Arson. John. This is Come me. Oh, we got another robbery. Oh, we got. Are these all robberies? No, wait. No, these aren't all robberies. They're just. I think this one right here is a. Well, we got one robbery, and this one's hunting. Arthur, I think. Come up here. No, fuck you, Dutch. I got other shit to do. <laughs> All right, let's head on over to Charles. We'll do some hunting, and then uh, we'll do that other robbery, and then we'll hit, hit up Dutch. This is Charles. No, this is a key. I thought that was a C, but I was wrong. That's a P. Pearson. Arthur, you free? Come on, are we gonna go fishing with Pearson? Oh no, we are sure, going. Old man. Man. Ah, enough of that old man nonsense. I'm in the prime of my life. Oh, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> How you getting out? Bored. You see that swamp, Arthur? That's God's own pantry. What are we hunting? Venison? Come on, let's go gather some crawfish. See oh. what else we can get. Crawfish? Yeah, crawfish. Finest eating there is. It's not just crawfish. No, there's monsters out there that'll eat a feller for fun. Oh, Arthur, I thought you were a man. No, sir. Huh. When it comes to prehistoric monsters, I am very much a coward. <laughs> now, what I have to do, Rowan? Come on, bro. Look for those trees across from us, and we'll take a look. I'm a starboard side. What? My left, your right. This is a boat, Arthur. Okay. Whatever you say. Okay. Go slow so I can see. My eyes aren't what they used to be. No, no. Ground is too high here. Keep following the shoreline. 
What exactly are we looking for? We're looking for low ground and a lot of muck. Come on, Arthur, row, boy, row! What is this pathetic speed? Is it because Pearson told me to go slow? Is that why? Is that why we're going at fucking one mile per hour? Pull us in over there. Here? Yeah, yeah, come on. There's more than crawfish in these waters. Stop your whining, please. It's beneath you. This is the place. Now tell me, Arthur, have you ever birthed a cow? What? No. Right, it's nothing like that, but it's equally as gruesome if you're squeamish. You're really selling this, aren't you? Now, do you see this hole? Yep. Well, it's sort of like a natural trap. Just want to stick your hand in. Watch. And there! <laughs> there, you see? Holy. Good. One girl. Hey, what's uh, up, Rocket? Long time no see, man. Hole. How's life? So, how long were you in the Navy? Oh, years. Well, it must have been a year, at least. Or close to that. That's quite a range. All water under the bridge now. No pun intended. Man, how long? I thought I thought I thought we were well, supposed there. to be hunting. Another Come crayfish on. hole. You see it? But we're out here hunting for crayfish. You try this, this time, Arthur. This isn't the hunting I wanted. Down deep and get right in there. They like to dig in. The little blighters. All right, I guess we're getting some crawfish. That's not to think about it too much. They're pretty, pretty decent here too. Come on. Oh, there it is. I got some. Nicely done. Why Ooh. don't you see if there's any more down there? Man, Pearson's putting me to work. Oh, oh, oh. I bet there's more down there. There we go. What did I tell you? <laughs> okay, come on. Let's try another hole. Won't be much come of on. a gumbo if we don't find some more. Man, how, how, how long are we going to be uh, looking for crawfish for? Come on, man. Oh, oh, oh. Something's going to happen soon, maybe? Get down. Oh, gator. Get down. We gotta get some gator. Talking about the creatures. There. There we Those go. That, that's something that's something yeah. more interesting right there. Three. And they're female. Must be guarding nests. I don't have a so, rifle on me though. Gator so. eggs. Really valuable. Even better eating. I'd love cooking with them. Okay. Tell you what. I'm gonna sneak over to the other side of them. Draw their attention. And then run like hell. Now, assuming I don't get eaten, you go plunder the nests. That's your plan? You're madder than I thought. Shh. I've done it before in Sumatra. It's easy. I've heard that line before. Oh, ye of little faith. Wait here, Mr. Morgan. So where's... Oh, is that the nest right there? I think that's the nest. No, that's another... That's probably another gator, huh? Yeah, I don't got my rifle on me, so we're not going to be killing no gators. I think that's the that that's definitely another gator. That's not a nest. Can you uh hurry it up, Pearson? I don't got our day, buddy. Yeah, come on. You seem to be paying attention to him. Yeah, yeah, oh, oh, there we go. Get rage. Oh, it was these ones in here. Yep. Thank you. Ah, oh, shit. They're heading back. Pearson, you didn't do your job right, Pearson. You didn't do your job right, Pearson. They're coming back. Where's the last one? Here it is. Yeah, yeah we got them all. Wait, there's more? Oh, no, we did get them all. Tell you later, Gators. Meow. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, they they ignored me. We're fine. Man, you you're not even rowing the boat. Here. Come on, you're making me do everything. All right, sir. Thanks. Take us back to the dock. Excellent. That's what I call teamwork. 
I don't think I've ever seen you move that fast. People pay a lot of money for those eggs. I'm told there's a collector in San Denis who gives top dollar for them. For military, of all things. Yeah, I've met him. He's quite the character. There we go. That was fun. Uh, Not really. I must get out more. Is that your idea of fun, is it? <laughs> it wasn't fun to me. Oh, what? Thank you. All right, we'll Here, do one more robbery. Have some crawfish. And give you some of those eggs. <laughs> <laughs> hey, maybe you could hatch that. Get yourself a new friend. There's a thought. A new reptilian best buddy to replace Mike, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna do one robbery. Well, the last robbery you can't. No, never mind. It's too late for that, it seems. All right. Or is it? No, no, it's still there. We're, we're chilling. We're chilling. Never mind. It's locked. Camp funds. Uh, I don't think I could buy anything else in camp, right? Only thing I can do in camp is restock and stuff, but it looks like we're not lowering anything. Where's that music coming from? Oh. There we go, give our depths. Up, oh, 24 buckles. Uh, let's check the ledger. Just to make sure there's nothing new that we can buy, you know? Make sure we got everything. Okay, we got everything, all right. So we still don't, we don't gotta worry about camp. Most, most we gotta worry about is, uh, oh, it looks like the robbery is not gone as I thought it was. So let's, might as well go do that real quick too. Is it because it's turning day, is that why? That was nighttime though. Hey, Arthur. Hey, what's up, Lenny? What let's go. Nothing? I don't believe you. It's just a little robbery, all right? Nothing serious. Good. What are you robbing? A stage. There's a stage coming through. According to the fella I met, it'll have a bunch of money aboard and no security whatsoever as it comes up the river trail between here and Catfish Jackson. Okay. That yeah, sounds worth investigating. You and, uh, who? I don't know. I I thought I'd do it on my own. It'll be unprotected. Won't be a huge take, but I should make out okay. There ain't no such thing as unprotected. Now, who you want to go with? I guess you. Now? I don't need no hand-holding offer. Oh, come on, kid. <laughs> but if we decide to do it once we've had it, I'm taking half the money. I mean, I even need All the right. money. Let's get going then. He should be on his way right now. All right, Lenny boy. Let's get this shit, buddy. It seems like only yesterday you and me was shooting our way in here to rob those fools. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll be glad to leave this place behind if I'm honest. Got a bad feel to it. At least it's got a roof. You got a roof. Of course, I'm outside with the juniors. Oh, you ain't even 20 years old. Your time will come. Let's go, girl. Follow me. I saw a good spot for an ambush. So who's the feller told you about this? It's a sound lead. I told you. And what did he have to gain by giving you this information? You mean, did I give him money or a gun? You're just gonna have to trust me on this one, Arthur. Okay. Okay, I do. You better you than Mike though. yourself the past six months. Don't forget, I was on the run for murder before falling in with you boys. For three years. It ain't like I'm new to any of this. Uh, those fellers who killed your pa? Yep. And I'd do it again right now. Of course. All right, we're on the ride to uh, wherever Lenny's leading us. So if we can go a lot faster, that'd be nice. I don't have anything against Lenny, but 
I don't want to. I don't want to be riding on a horse all day. You know, I want action. We're bound to get some action here on this robbery, though. That's for damn certain. Do I still have a mask on? No, I don't. So I will put that back on later as well. I could try to get some gain here while uh on my way to the stagecoach with Lenny. But nah, let's not do that. Nothing else these boys can talk about? I guess not. Alright. Hold on now. So how far is this, Lenny? Come on, bro. I don't got all day, Lenny boy. Okay, here oh, we are. Okay. Let's leave the horses off the road to the right here. Yeah, I don't got much ammo for my boom boom sticks. I figured we take up position behind these rocks. Yeah, seems good. The stage should be coming up the river from Catfish Jackson any time now. You know what? We might as well uh, clean my guns, right? Fuck it. Oh, the condition is pretty bad here. Are you sure about that? It ain't gonna you be a cakewalk. As soon as they're close enough, we'll jump out, hit them fast. Oh, wait. Almost got the mask. Just wait for my lead, okay? Benny. I said, wait for my lead. This is a robbery. Drop your weapons and put your hands in the air. I said, drop the weapons. Okay, okay. Just take it easy. All right, boy. Anyone else? Anyone inside there? Answer me. Last chance. Come out, or we're coming in. Shit. U.S. Marshal. Oh, One of you fellas better pull that Good over there, Lynn boy. You're asking for it, you bastard. Bye bye. You alive? Yeah. Are you? Evidently. That was not the way I was expecting things to go. You took us into a trap. Look. I'm telling you, it was good information. You sure, Lenny boy? Look, look, there's some money here. Not much. Yeah, it ain't much, because it was a trap. Stage companies do this all the time. They set up traps oh, to catch fools. Shit. Like you and me. I feel like a fool. Well, that's good, because you are a fool. But you're still alive, so don't worry too much about it. Come on, get out of here before any more turn up. All right. See you back at camp. Uh, yeah, that definitely wasn't worth. Only 20 bucks for all that? Yeah, that, that, that was not it. All right, let's go back to camp. Uh, and uh, we'll have Arthur go to sleep. Yep. Bring up his horse. Maybe the dead eye one because we're down bad on that. I was gonna hunt that deer, but never mind, because I scared it off. Some wild animals? <laughs> what? Yeah. Come on, man. Oh, that's just a fucking tree stump. Never mind. I was about to hunt that shit. Oh, never mind. It's a fucking grave. Is it. Wait, is this Kiran's grave? I guess it is. Oh, RIP that tricky, or whatever that was. No 
Heaven on earth. Hello, Arthur. No man unleashed. No real land. No pure land, or none of that stuff. Dutch spouts. And what's this? Just gonna get shot like any other hoodlum. Oh, poker. That's what that is. Okay. Don't really care too much about that. Just something to make us better. Kill them, folks. Faster or run away. Dutch could wait until I wake up and get all my energy back. We'll just sleep until the morning. That's all we'll do. Oh, wait, I forgot my crib is right here. Oh wait, oh, wait, 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 where did, where did all these ammo come from? The fuck? I thought we ran out. Oh, I grabbed them all last time. So I guess I'll grab them again, huh? Nah, actually, I'm not gonna bother. Then we go to sleep. And morning. So five hours sleep for my boy Arthur. Buy the bandolier and gun belt equipment so you can hold am more ammunition. Leading challenges will yeah, allow you to upgrade them. Alright, time to get to old Dutchy boy who wanted to talk to me a while ago and I just ignored his ass. Alright, Dutch, what do you want, Mr. Troublemaker? So, Arthur, you get the deciding vote. About what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches? Or deal with business the right way? We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town. A bank that he no doubt protects. A town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a vindictive little power broker who rules by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You want to leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. You just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever going to pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Farmers. But we need seed capital, and we need to leave. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. Trust me. We've trusted you a bunch Arthur. of times, Dutch. If it's business, well, business is business. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. He already Arthur, has. Come on. And you I had no be saying right it. about this one. I am. Ah, bro. Every one, every I've single thing we've done with you. And usually been I've been fucked. right. If you say ah, so. brother. Quit You're wrong about that, Dutch boy. It does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. Man, I probably got to row the that boat? boat too, bro. We're headed to a settlement called Le Grave. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these waters like the back of his hand. Why do we need a boat? So we can attack Bronte's mansion from the swamp. Catch him off guard. He knows we survived the trolley station, so he'll be expecting some kind of reprisal. All right. Okay, makes sense. See, I do still possess some capacity for rational thought, <laughs> Arthur. <laughs> okay, follow me. Get off. We're going full speed Thank ahead. You. For what? For taking my side back there. It ain't about sides. Oh, shit, I didn't know what you were turning. What are you doing? I didn't know you were turning sides, Dust. Feels Come like on, Jose man. Feels like lost his spine. This move on Bronte. Is it for the bank job 
more revenge for what happened at the trolley station. Both. Neither. What does it matter? We need to hit that bank. And Bronte has the police and just about everything else in San Denis in his back pocket. He also Ooh. set us up. And lest we forget, took young Jack. I understand. I just got a lot of pots on the boil, given all the folks who's out gunning for us. You all seem to have forgotten how money is made and what it takes to support 20 people. Let alone what it takes to give 20 people a new life overseas. With all due respect, Dutch, is this Tahiti plan really going to work out? No. Nope. You tell me, Arthur. Is it? No. Nope. Have some goddamn Faith. I am bending over backwards to make a future for us. Oh, I know, but, 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 when did you become so small minded? Whenever you started bringing us your child of trouble, break up the family, go our separate ways, just tell me. Of course not. This isn't a prison camp. I am not forcing anybody to stay. So either we're in this together. Working together to get out together, or we're not. Anyway, like we're here. here we are. Let me do the talking. Must be the fellas here to see Thomas. Must be. Why is there? Why did I see my mouse pointing at this coin specifically? It's not even the whole corner I see. It's just like Thomas, a little chunk. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's gonna help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite the adventure fishing for catfish. Now, my friend. Can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you bring him trouble, it won't be no trouble for me. Good. My business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find him. It should be pretty late for you right now, right? I mean, if you're tired, you, you go ahead and go to sleep. I don't, I don't mind. Lively. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number, big ones. Great. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare ah, you, see. surely. Well, I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a. So pretty much when I start seeing it's with like a big mouth, one Dutch. or midnight for you, huh? Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas more of a jester than a gunslinger. Well, if you say so, Mr. Dutch. This way, come on, this way. Follow me here, and <laughs> stay on the high ground. Me on my, on the other hand, my sleep schedule is straight up like fucked. I'm not gonna lie. Sleep like Down around here, we can't be too picky six, there, seven a.m. The earliest would be like 5 a.m. probably. Got a couple of crayfish traps up ahead. Right, looks like I'll be the one going out to check them. Maybe. Mr. Dutch, you keep a lookout for company. Mr. Arthur, check yep, the traps. Yep, figured as much. Nothing. This one's empty. All right. I got a few more set over this way. Come on. I don't want to know what just touched my leg. Mr. Dutch, you show you the right fellas to be going after Angelo Brunty? Oh, he's much more the kind of reptile I can handle. Now stay oh, close. I see a gator sure over you there. My line. Oh, I fully intend to, Thomas. You too, Mr. Arthur. See that gator you can see over why there? Even swamp waiting hasn't caught on as a pastime, can't you? I love it out here. Peace. Nobody bothering you now. Well, I'm, I'm not going for that trap sometime. Come on. The night folk. Yep, some strange people around these parts. Wider than the animals they are. Well, this that? just gets better and better. 
Oh, I think I fit. I think I ran into some night folk before. Killed their ass. Oh, yeah. They look like fucking zombies or some shit. God damn, we're going in. Deep. Whoa. Stop where you are. It's a gator. Just stay as still as you can. Ooh, that's a big boy, too. That's a big boy. Yeah, that's what I thought. Back up, you right, gator fool. Let's keep moving. I got another trap by that small island up here. I don't know what's taking Jewel so long with that boat. I he's think we are dead. all equally keen to find him. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Got killed by the gator. Oh. Uh-oh. Um, we're getting surrounded here, sir. Thomas, I think we're getting surrounded, buddy. I saw two of them staring right at us, bud. The hand here, Mr. Arthur. This trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. We gotta get we gotta get attacked by gators. I, I know already, bro. I Ooh. Ooh, some gators got to this Guess one. Guess something didn't want to be caught. My gosh. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. I guess this was. No, but only some huge could do this. Fantastic. Legendary gator. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. All right. I suppose this can wait. Let's go. Shouldn't we be heading back? What the fuck? Shouldn't we be heading back? This this kid's already dangerous as fuck. We should be heading back if anything. Come on. What the fuck are we doing? Hold up. Yeah, we got a whole posse of theaters here, man. This ain't good. I, I can already tell this is not gonna go out well. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good eating. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. Something bad's gonna happen, man. I we really should have run into jewels by now. I reckon we should split up so we can search both sides. Okay, Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. You, we'll go left. You what? Just fucking keep your eyes pussy, open. Dutch. You fucking pussy. Making me do all the hard work. What a loser, man. Watch, I'm gonna be the one be it. Uh, I've gotta get attacked here, man. I gotta get attacked here. Alright, let's go ahead and maintain my other gun. My golden boy. Yeah, there we go. Put this baby back. I gotta find his corpse to go to Get in the alligator infested swamp, bro? The less I, the least amount I'll take is probably like 100 k That's the least, bro. In the tree! Oh, you still alive? Must be him. Over this way! You're in the tree. What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. You okay up there? There's a monster. Where? Mastiff, it nearly ate me. Hey, where'd he go? It's it's out there. What? A big gator. Biggest I ever saw. Big and nasty. Knocked me off the boat and chased me over here. 
You must be Jews. Yes. Where is the boat? Over there. I ran. I... <laughs> okay. <laughs> and uh, where'd this monster swim off to? I think that way. Ah, uh, brother, I don't, even, I don't think I can even kill this bitch, not even with my blinked out pistols. I got the scare! It's over here! <sighs> the gator's Stop. gonna come. <clears throat> Someone's gonna die here, brother. Got loose. Go. Someone is going to die here. Good man! Who? I got All no right. idea, but someone's let's gonna get back die. To the dock. Yes, please, let's go. Thank God. So, uh, who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules? We are very happy to have finally made your acquaintance. I thought I was gonna be out here all night. What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice Trying to get as big as I've ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Where is it? Oh, 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 yeah, it's coming. I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we clear. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. Well, Jules is dead. You'll see any giant monster <laughs> long before ah! this one in there. Got a couple of cracked gunslingers here with the guns loaded. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Yeah, this is where Jules dies. Pull! Oh, here it comes. Oh, wait. Oh, and yep, Jules? there it goes. <laughs> there he goes. No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Arthur, go. Oh, Come on, right. you, you fucking pussy, Dutch. Right, you motherfucking pussy, Dutch. Fuck. I'm going, man. Jesus Christ, Dutch. How about you come in to help me too, fucking pussy? By the time I get there, he's... Shit, where'd he go? Okay, that doesn't help at all. How about you fucking hop in and help, Dutch, you fucking pussy? <laughs> I'm here, Jules, I'm here, buddy. I'm coming. I got you, Sim. I got you. Oh, God, no. Oh, shit, he's leaving a trail of blood. Dutch! Shoot something! Man, I'm gonna get attacked. Oh, God, no. Please hurry. I'm going, Jules. I'm going. Oh, God, no. Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> can, can you guys at least bring the couple of warning <laughs> shots just to pretend you care? Where is it? I got you covered. Come on, come on. At least move the phone a little bit closer while I'm on my way there, Ricky. Come on. I'm going. Hurry, hurry. Give me the ball. Oh shit, I'm out of stamina. Put him here. Come on. I'm making my way. Good rush, me Dutch. Yeah. This leg hurt pretty bad. This should be okay. Yeesh. Get in. That's fucking bad. Finish that son of a bitch, Arthur. We'll be alright, Jules. Hold on. Shoot that thing. Where'd he go? Come on, shoot it. I think he's going. Shit, that is one big old gate. 
Oh, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. Bro, we, 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 we gotta stop okay, the bleeding. Son. Okay, hold on. Here we go. You're gonna be okay. Just bro, it, it looked like a fucking funny ass rag, bro. I heard that. Man, Dutch, you, you, you is one big fucking pussy. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I've stopped the bleeding. I think he'll be okay if he don't get a fever. We can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Oh shit, he's coming back. back. He God damn it. Put every bullet you got in him. Reloading. He's under the water. I'm guessing that's gonna be a legendary ammo I'll need to hunt later. You're gonna be okay, kid. Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and mad. That's unusual. Normally, the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever seen you squeal before, Dutch. <laughs> I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules has been bitten. Oh my God. There's a monster out here. He's been bitten, but he's alive. Just keep him warm. Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you, both of you. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Thomas. Where can we find you? You just meet me back here. Very good. Can one of you help me put the boat back out? Sure. I'm gonna head back to camp and placate the irritable Miss O'Shea, who's causing more trouble. I'll collect the boys. Meet you back here, Arthur. <clears throat> Mr. Arthur? <clears throat> Old Bronte. Bad man. I know. Killed some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. You be safe. We got monsters out here. <sighs> well. Yeah, I'm guessing that gator I'm gonna have to kill for a uh, legendary gator skin or some shit like that. At least that's what it seems like. Where the fuck are we? Oh, oh we're just in the middle of the woods. No tree pursuit. Need you now, girl. Yeah. All right, and anything else we need to do here? Uh, let's hop on over to Saint Denis. Uh. We'll go do the Charles stuff, then we'll head up the the gun store to buy some ammo. So we're running low on that. Yeah, I figured as much. My ten dollars got to be the same thing. Out of the damn way. I probably won't go back and kill her for a while, because all it gives me is like what cosmetic stuff, right? Maybe a uh, upgraded pouch, but I won't really even <laughs> use the pouch too often anyways. So I'll, I'll just leave that until like after the game or some shit. Who knows? Got the clothing store here. Uh, you know what? Let's stop by and see if there's any new drip for sale, huh? Might as well. I got 2000 and nothing to spend it on. Hey, careful there. Mind yourself. I got robbed here before. Hello, come on in. Yeah, I figured as much. Now, let me see. Any new outfits, brother? Hello. The Saint Denis. Nah, I got the best one, it looks like. I don't really care for these. Nope. 
I take pride in my selection here. Everything here is of exceptional quality. All right, brother. Smell you later. No problem at all. You don't got anything that I want, so it's time for me to dip. Thank you for your help. Now it's time for me to hit up Charles. Yoink. Where's my horse going? Come on, girl. It's up here, that's why. Enjoy the show, if that's possible. What's this show then? Mr. Charles. I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all. Just wait until you see his work. It's very progressive. You got a jealous well, man. I'm not so very man, sure how I feel like. about progression. Paintings or otherwise. Come on. I think that it's Greek. Too modern for my taste. Look at these idiots. Excuse me, Mr. Chatonet. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <gasps> well, that explains <laughs> the decadence of those Hottentots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here. In her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Why would you be showing it to that man? That's my mama. <gasps> as nude as the day she was born. Stop looking at my husband's buttocks. Mm -hmm. Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. A nerve on you. That's it. Oh, oh, come on, Mildred. This is no place for us. Come here, son of a bitch. Oh, you God. filthy little man. Oh, and oh the horse will leave hey, I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. Ooh, you got quite the strong arm on you there, buddy. Pow! Ooh! Pow! It's not the daylights out of you. Where's my top hat? Yeah, there it is. What? What's this hat? Oh, actually, no, never mind. I'll give you back my top hat. All right, Charles. You done hiding, buddy? It's well and truly over. Let's get out of here. Come on. I know a place where I can disappear for a few days. Let's go. I'm coming. I'm coming. No need to rush, Charles. No need to rush. This way. This way. Come on. I think we are okay. The exhibition. What can you say? It was not boring. <laughs> that it was not. Archie test people, push them. I thought I was a fraud, a no talent brush washer. Now I'm not sure. We provoke emotions, no? You keep provoking emotions like that, and all your canvases left punch holes through. I told you I was a whole ass. <laughs> you did, and you are. Now maybe go be an asshole somewhere else for a while. Ah, here we are. I know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. <laughs> She's not gonna let him stay. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Perhaps. Right now, it seems like the only thing it'll get me is a kick in the balls. Oh, you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to beat a. Or something. <laughs> or not. Alright. I don't think I do. No way, I do use the Lancaster. That's that's my that's yeah, that's the one I pimped out a little bit, yeah. Alright, might as well maintain this too, huh? 
clean this baby. And there we go. Got nothing but pimped out guns on me now. Oh, we're coming up with a group? Arthur, there you are. Come on. Okay, we got Thomas. Let's get going. Right you are. Yeah, Lenny, John, Dutch, and Bill. All right. Is this where Lenny dies? No, no, he doesn't die here, does he? <laughs> hey, yeah, Bill, we'll find you out were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling, pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you though I do. <clears throat> well, love, leaving love aside, I... <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. Oh, we're here already. That's fantastic. Now you pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Come on, quick. Stay quiet. We're taking out my swanky shotgun. <laughs> Uh, let's bring out my, my dual pistols instead. Lenny, Bill, you're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Arthur, let's go. <clears throat> let's go. What, John? What do you mean, Dutch? I'm right here. Right behind. Bro, fucking Dutch. Asshole, man. Find some cover. Two up ahead. Have you got a shot? Something creepy about these statues. <laughs> you don't like naked women. You did. <laughs> Coming in, Bronte. Slowly and menacingly with my double pistols. Shoot that lock, Arthur. Man, I got my own shotgun. Get that out of here. We got more inside. Somewhere. Oh, right out 
out the window. Manny, keep that door covered. Check up in there. He's not down here. God damn it. Sayonara. Right. Where are you hiding? Oh, Bronte. I'm coming for you. And Bronte. Ah, you're gone, damn. What a oop. <laughs> I'm sorry, friend. I, I, no, name your price. Name your price. Every man have a price. Eh? Okay, okay. No, I surrender. I surrender. I Should we kill him? Nah, let's take him to Dutch. You can carry him. I ain't touching that piece of shit. Let's see what you got on them first, huh? Ooh, 150. Jeez, you man, man's is rich. I think Dutch wants to have a little chat, Mr. Bronte. The law is coming. Oh, I have to go down. What are you doing over there? Come on, come on. Come on, Morgan! We're getting the hell out of here! Okay, I still got all my guns. Stay with me, Arthur. You're not the one carrying the fucking body here. Sorry, boys. No one is going to jail today. Put him in the front. Bill. Help. You gotta tie this motherfucker up. Oh, come on, Lenny. All right, come on. Let's get out of here. Yep. Oh. Wakey, wakey. Hey, big man. We gonna ransom you or what? You're pussy. Oh, I am. Because from where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money, it weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing. You mean nothing. You stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this <sighs> country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you gonna say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. right. They are good at smelling filth, huh? So <laughs> filth! Has got to be this Our friends of Pinkerton are gonna come and rescue you, you repulsive little maggot! Call them now! You call them! Are we gonna 
feed him to the gators? Oh, yep. Jesus. What in your philosophy books cover feeding a fellow? The goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. That part. I don't know. Well, I do. It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. I figure it might as well be him. Be almost done with this chapter. And head on to chapter five, maybe. Revenge is a fish best eaten. All right, let's go talk to Dutch again. Is he up or down? That's the question. I'm telling you, Dutch, this is the way to do this job. More the distraction Arthur. will buy you all the time you need. I don't like it, Jim. Look. The bank. Karen, Tilly, Abigail. I sent them all. They all say the same thing. There's no more than one armed guard. And the police? It's a city. There are police. But as far as we can tell, the patrols will all be going this way when Abigail and I cause the diversion. That's the opportunity. What do you think, Arthur? I don't see we have a lot of choice. We linger around here. We know we're dead. But the plan? We got a decent bunch. We know how to fight. The city cops don't seem so tough as long as we move fast. I reckon doing it in the day with a distraction. If that's what Jose is saying. It's as good a plan as any. I, th I think I agree. Can we do it at night? There's the drama of just getting into the bank. Can't do that silently. No, pick us off far easier. I know. I'm, I'm just making sure. Every plan is a good plan if we execute it properly. Every problem we had was because we did not execute properly. Even Blackwater, from my understanding. You're right. <laughs> Let's rob this bastard. Everyone get some rest. Hey, right this, is definitely, this is definitely where Lenny dies. Bro. Travel light. This is where definitely, this is, this is where Lenny dies. Oh, damn. You got everything, Arthur. Sure. So, we rob ourselves a bank, and within Six weeks, we're living life anew in a tropical idol, spending the last of our days as banana farmers. Let's get out of this godforsaken place and go rob ourselves a bank! Yeah! Yeah! Let's go, let's go! Looking fancy out here. That whip, Mr. Matthews! This is it, gentlemen. The last one. Where have we heard that before? What has happened to you, John? You lost all your heart. I'm just trying to stay real about all this. Real? Oh, how I detest that word. So devoid of imagination. How soon are we shipping out? As soon as we get a passage organized. Boat down to Argentina and another around the Cape. What about the money in Blackwater? We're just gonna leave that behind? <laughs> Forget that. It's gone. You all talk like it's the only goddamn money in the world. We're gonna take that and more. Take it from the people who take it from us. This isn't some hick town hundred dollar operation. This is a big city bank. Right. With security, guards, police. Hosea has done his reconnaissance. We've been over this. The plan. One last time. Hosea and Abigail draw out the police. We go in calm and fast. John and Lenny secure the front doors. Javier takes the side exit. Phil, Micah, and Charles control the crowd. Me and Arthur deal with the bank manager and vault. Got it? Got it. Yeah. Got it. Good. All right, that's enough talk. Gentlemen, let us go ahead. How long do you need? Not long. Fifteen minutes or less. You'll know by the noise. Any problems? We'll see you in camp. Good luck, gentlemen. Right on! Yeah! Everybody know the drill. We
We head in hard and stay calm. They won't be expecting us. Any minor trouble, head back to camp. We'll leave in a few days. You good, Bill? Sure. Then right on with Charles. We don't want to be seen heading in like some posse of country outlaws. This is it, cowboys! One more time! <sighs> One more time. This ain't got to be the last time. Yeah. That's for damn sure. Let's go! It ain't got to end here. I know that. Why can't I just wear this suit like 90% of the time? That's my question. Cause I would love to, I would love to rock this suit. I'm not gonna lie, for the rest of the game. Nice and easy through town now, boys. Catch up here. Gentlemen, robbing thieves. Oh. How do you do? Folk like this. They stole what this country could have been. Stay cool, fellas. Act natural. Wait for Hosea to do his thing. <laughs> Act natural, this guys with a bunch of bags on his shoulders. Like there's a law gun. over the other side. Have a modicum of faith, John, will you please? Soon as we get out, load everything onto the wagon here. This ain't gonna go out well. <laughs> I love that Hosea! He is a true <coughs> artist. Just a bunch of guys with guns. Ew, someone just left a pile of horse dung on the floor. Gentlemen, let's go! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen! This is a hold up! Don't do nothing stupid! <laughs> Who do you think you are? Okay, now then, Arthur, would you please have Senior Bank Manager here open up the vault? Up. Oh, come on. Arthur, you're with me. Let's clear this out. I need the combination for these safes. How about the combination? Come on, speak. Speak or die. Now. First I got it. Okay, now, what's the second number? 72. All right, should be one more number. Last number. Come on. 54. Oh, I overran it. You okay, I'm in. Mr. Ab, 54. <laughs> what did I tell you? Would you look at that? Joint, joint, joint. Joint, how much is this? How much is Get this? Out of here. Come on, Shit. let's go. What? That was it? Okay. Come on, we gotta rob a bank. We gotta rob it right, right? Come on, that was only one. We got a problem out here. Come out! It's over. Shit, Abigail. Dutch, get out here! Get out here now! Someone must have squealed. Never should have gone after Bronte, Dutch. Mr. Milton, <clears throat> let my friend go. Or folks, they are gonna get shot unnecessarily. Your friend? <laughs> Why would I do that? Come on, Milton. It's over. No more bargains, no more deals. Mr. Milton, this is America. 
You can always cut a deal. I've given you enough chances. Come on. Oh, Jose is gonna die. Boom. Yep. No. Oh, God damn it. No. Dutch. Jose. Oh, this is this is definitely where Lenny dies. Killed, arrested. I couldn't help. Well, we better go. We'll be next. What you think? I reckon me and Lenny try and find a way across the roofs. If you'll cover us. Sure, sure. Go on. All right, let's go. I got the gun ready. Dutch! 
follow you. We gotta keep quiet and keep moving, or we're gonna be dead in the next few minutes. Follow me, one at a time. Arthur, you go next. Come on, follow me. Keep it down. There's law everywhere. All of you, leave the area now. There's more law down there. Find these men. All of you, find these men. You, have you seen anything? <clears throat> no, not yet. Find them, find them. Come on, all of you. Shit. Looks like they're heavily patrolling around here. Arthur. Arthur, we can get in here. Don't believe it. They knew we were coming. Just like your ferry job in Blackwater. Ain't nothing like that. <clears throat> what now? I don't know. I don't. This whole town is filled with cops. Well, how long are we gonna stay here? Well, a few hours? We go back to camp? They're gonna get every last one of us. I know they're gonna be watching the roads. I got it. A boat. What you mean? We stay here till nightfall. Then we sneak on down to the docks. We get ourselves out of here. Yeah, well, where? Any place will do. That's all I got. We leave. We lie low. We come back for the rest in a few weeks. I'm guessing it's that. We die out there right now. Exactly. Now, everybody, calm down. I mean, oh, look at us. All the guys are up to no good. Started making trouble in the neighborhood. Okay, follow me and keep your heads down. Head for the dock. Go, go, go. Stay down and keep quiet. You're the only one talking right now, Dutch. Can't stay here. Let's cut through the train. Follow me. Someone's coming. Guard to the left. Get down and stay out of sight. The other guy's not following us? He's gonna stay over there? Someone's coming. Duck. Quick, hide behind the chair. I hear someone coming. They could clearly see, see your head, Dutch. To check the train. They just robbed Lemoyne National Bank. It's not like they're gonna take the first line out of town. Milton. Milton said a lot. Come on, I don't want to be out here all night. Oh shit! Oh, oh no, I'm just trying. You didn't even check it properly. You just stood there. <laughs> Come on. What about the other guys? Shit. Stop, Arthur. What? What would he see, Dutch? Oh, damn it. We're never gonna get past these fellas. Arthur, head over to the water. See if you can draw them out. Draw them out? How? I don't know. Make a noise. Whistle or something.
Okay, oh, so now the boys come. All right. Get in cover and stay out of sight. You're the one standing up, Dutch. How about you get back to crouching? You've wasted enough time on these fools. Spencer said. See there? Sure. What you think? I don't know. They're watching for us. Maybe. Maybe not. Well, well, of course they are. What do you mean, maybe not? They ain't not? just waiting there for no reason. Yeah. Let me think for a second. I'll deal with them. What? How? I can't kill all of them silently. So, when they chase me, you go the other way. What are you talking about? You heard what I said. Charles, oh, no! I like it. Real brave. What in the hell? Who is... Excuse me, buddy! Hey, stop! Stop, stop! That is one of the most beautiful acts I ever saw. Come on. Charles, your sacrifice will not be in vain. So what, we just gotta let Charles get arrested, I guess? So, uh, Lenny's now? dead. Well, John got, got arrested. Sure. Hosea's dead. This boat ain't going to Tahiti Abigail, I don't know if but she I got away know. or got arrested. John, Probably uh, got away. Lenny. Hosea, that wasn't good. I know. So what are we gonna do now? <coughs> Guess I'm gonna introduce myself to the captain. Give him some of this gold to secure his silence. And find out where we're heading. How do I look? Like a shifty, no good killer on the run from the law. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Hey, who are you? Forgive me. A stowaway. Can I see the captain, please? I come in peace. <sighs> where were the other guys at? Well. It's gonna take a little more gold, but I think we're gonna be okay. This captain, he is a, a fine fella, a New Englander from the Cape. The rest of the ship is Frenchmen. They're heading down to the islands, taking some Pennsylvania coal. Now, apparently, we're gonna be able to slip ashore in northern Cuba in a couple of days. That's so. Apparently. What are we gonna do in Cuba, Dutch? Hold up for a while, then hurry back, gather up the rest of our family. At least we got some money now. Money and loyalty. With that, you can do whatever you please. So you reckon they'll follow us to Cuba? Like Colonel Waxman on a jolly? I highly doubt it. I reckon we hold ourselves to ourselves, and this is done and dusted. Let's hope so. I ain't no sailor, but, uh... <clears throat> that cloud look like good news to you. Uh-oh, a storm's on its way! Ow. Wake up! Everybody! Wake up! Wake up! Come on, Arthur! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! I don't know where we are getting off of this boat! You come on! Would you get a move on, you sleepy bastard? Please, Lord, hey, I'll be right behind you. And 
not that few boy, right? I think so. Arthur Morgan. Welcome to the new world. I don't got my boom sticks on me anymore in here. Walking on this nice little trail here. Slowly but surely. <laughs> How much longer is this gonna be? Oh, new camera. Gonna zoom in on Arthur's face, okay. It's casually scrolling. Oh, oh, he's on his knees. Out of energy. Oh, he's getting back up. He's getting back up. Oh. We can look around freely now. But we can't move around freely. Still strolling, can't sprint, can't do nothing, just slowly strolling. How far are we to our location? Oh, new camera. Oh, and he's passing out. Back up. And he's back to strolling. Huh. Chapter 5 Warm up. 